guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope you're all okay, I haven't done a video in such a long time. Um, I thought I'd bring you a home renovation update video today because we've more or less finished our kitchen, utility room and dining room. So if you'd like to see um, a before and after of each room, then please keep watching. just been plastered outside in the hallway but this is the kitchen door um, needs finishing once the hallway's finished um, then we go in and we've got our new floor um, absolutely love this wall and uh, this wood it's like cardine flooring so it's like strong hard wearing and um, it's very flexible before we put down so then we've got our lovely blue wall we weren't sure about the navy but absolutely love it now this is our little pantry it's actually a mess <laughs> right now but um it's for like to keep our hoover our mop clothes rail and um obviously food but i need to sort that out that's not been a priority but gonna get that sorted very shortly and then we come across here and we've got a little kitchen island um from ikea the stools are all from ikea also so yeah i think that really goes with the kitchen nicely we wanted something because it's such a big open space we wanted something that we don't have to always go in our dining room we can sit here and have breakfast so yeah there's two stools up there um and that's what it looks like against that wall there is two shelves on this side i'm looking for whisk wicker baskets for so i can put like tea towels and um just Add storage really we've got our radiator here which I absolutely adore I think they just make the room um, obviously you've got your normal style radiators but I think these add character so this is our kitchen our Ren kitchen here this is this side we've got our range master oven and these tiles um, are from Tile Giant, I want to say. I've got my little um, conversion board from the range, my kettle, and my toaster from Breville. Breville? Yeah. Which I think are really cute. There's my bin here um, from Dunelm. And then coming over to this side of the kitchen, we've got the sink dishwasher dishwasher's in here just some under sink storage and another cupboard there and a little cupboard this side but yeah i love our sink it's a range master sink um we've got a deep um bowl there and then a half bowl and then also a range master tap just think it's really it's just my style i love it um we've got the uh, fridge over this side we still haven't managed to buy ourselves a double fridge freezer just because of money doing the house up but we will eventually one of my favorite features of the kitchen is this um, shelving we actually made these out of um, scaffold boards and then got the old scaffold scaffold um, what they call brackets so yeah I love this into the dining room it's so nice to have all the rooms like matching floors and like it just looks it just all flows now so again we've got the same flooring in here it's just our dining room that we had before we do want a bigger one but that'll do us for now this unit was in lovely potty this unit was in the hallway 
um, but we've taken that out because we're going to build ourselves a shoe unit in there. So I put that in here, which I think looks really nice with the telly above there. And then we've got this sofa, which will go in our lounge when it's done. Um, but we will have a, like a fold out sofa bed there for when people want to come stay. And this is kind of our summer lounge as well as a dining room. So we've got our lounge at the back, uh, front of the house, but that's for winter because it's going to have a log burner in it and it's just going to be a kind of a snug for me and Tommy rather than a room where everyone can play whereas this one we can put a box of all Freddy's toys in and he can play in and it's going to have the wood floor so easy clean up here none of these little decorative bits will probably stay where they are but just for the time being this is my lovely little pot that my nana made I just put some lavender in there these eventually, I think I've said before, we want to do bifold indoors, but again, that's money. Um, there's just a mirror in here for the minute because our, well, we don't have a bedroom um, and everywhere is really dark, so you can see in this mirror. And we've just got a window there and the lights are the same as the ones in the kitchen and utility, which I really like actually the kitchen one. I'll show you going back through, we've got a bar I don't know what they're called, like a bar light on that one. And then, I don't know why there's a ball up there. And then the same in the, there as in the dining room. To the utility room all the doors are the same this handle's actually falling off at the minute but yeah and the lights are the same obviously the kitchen well the units we've made match the ones in the kitchen we've got our washing machine our cat's food and our cat's beds um no ironing boards there but i'm not really sure why you'll you'll have seen before that i had a massive um old because um, this was all like, I'll show you in a video, but this was all like outside taps and this was the old m meter uh, thing, but I think that's in there, I don't know how to get to it. Um, and then we've got the new um, switchboard there, so a lot better. We've got another one of them little radiators, but a, a single one instead of a double one. So obviously it's a smaller room. Just put that back. Um, then, yeah, as I say, it's really handy. We've got um, some extra cupboards in here for, I don't know, you always find stuff to put in there. We've got cleaning stuff all in here, craft stuff and outdoors bits in there, and then just the cat stuff in there. I like to keep the microwave in here because I just don't like a microwave in the kitchen. So it have either been put away or it's quite nice in this room. Again, we've got a range master sink, but this one's a full bowl um, rather than a half and um, again really deep and then the range master tap got this lovely new sorry about the clothes outside um, got this lovely new window and door um, because there was a wooden windows and doors in there before and then the same shelf as we done in the kitchen you know I just really like these they add character and just a nice place to display all your little bits so that's the end result guys i hope you enjoyed watching the video and seeing the before and afters um if you do like this video give it a thumbs up click subscribe and let me know in the comments what you think what you like about the kitchen what you don't like what you'd have done differently i'm always up for ideas and um, seeing what everyone else would have done so yeah i'll see you in the next video bye